guys, it is the Turtle Girl. Welcome to the channel or welcome back to the channel. As you can see, we have a little package here today. I have been waiting for this because I think it might hold the solution to actually growing live plants in a turtle tank. So when I heard Aquarium Co-op was gonna be sending this to me, I was super duper excited. So we are gonna go ahead and open this package and see what's in here. But before we get started, make sure to the subscribe button and ring the notification bell down below so you can see all of my future videos. I make turtle videos, pet videos, and fun stuff like this every single Friday and you don't want to miss out. So hit the subscribe button and we're gonna open up this mysterious package. Here we go. Oh, yes, stickers. I'm a huge fan of stickers. Ooh, uh, look at these. These are really pretty. I'm excited to put these somewhere. You guys, I never thought I'd do this, but there's live plants, so we're gonna try these out. This is the goods right here. All right. So just like before we get started and getting into this, this is not sponsored by Aquarium Co-op or anything. They just sent me this because they thought I might like to try it out. So this is Aquarium Co-op's new easy planter. Now, you guys know I am by no means an expert on anything plants. In fact, I am a self-proclaimed basically a brown thumb. I've tried keeping plants with my turtles before and it just has never worked out. And so for people like me, who basically just can't keep plants alive, they created this new little product and I'm gonna show you how it works. So basically this is just like a little planter where you can put your potted live plants into your tank and it just holds it. And I'm super excited about these and think that they would be really great for turtles because those of you who have turtles know that turtles will move stuff around, they will nose in the gravel, they'll uproot your plants, they'll eat your plants. And really that's been one of my main reasons I have never tried keeping plants in the turtle tank is because the turtles just move them around or like tear them to shreds. So I think this is a great solution if your turtle is just bigger and might push around the plants. Okay, so they did send me some plants which we are going to put into the planter now. This is a java fern. I'm like so trying to be so gentle. Okay, here's the java fern. Ooh, look at this. Okay, so basically this plant just drops into the holder and now it's going to be secured in this thing that's weighted so it, in theory, should be a lot harder for the turtle to move around. And if you're terrible with plants like I am, you might be like, well, what about just like the plant itself keeping the plant alive? Well, they have a solution for that. These are root tabs. So these are like tiny little pills for your plants like this. See that? And this you just stick into the rock wool, which is the stuff in the bottom of the plant. And I don't know if you can see that little green thing right there but that is the fertilizer. And so that is the fertilizer that we put right next to the plant. So that'll be helping to fertilize it. And you just drop it in right here and you have like a cute little potted plant to put in your aquarium that supposedly your turtle will not be able to kick around. So I'm gonna go ahead and set up the other one because I've got two plants here. All right, here is thing number two. And then this here is a dwarf Sagittaria. Hello. Oh, look at it, it's so cute. Okay, so I'm gonna put a root tab in this one. That's done there. And then just, boom. How easy was that? So I'm really, really excited to try these with the turtles because theoretically he won't be able to move these around. Now, if your turtle is just gonna eat the plants anyway, then I mean, there's kind of no way to protect against that. I mean, if your turtle's gonna eat plants, your turtle's gonna eat plants. But if you've shied away from keeping live plants with turtles because you knew that they were gonna move them around or they're just gonna get uprooted, I think this is a really, really cool solution. This, you can leave the plant in the rock wool and eventually like it has a hole in the bottom and so it can actually grow its roots out from the bottom so if you have substrate it can grow those roots into the bottom without the turtle being able to really dig it up or if you don't have substrate and you just have like a bare bottom tank then you can just sit it on the bottom of the tank and as i've been telling many of you in my react series put more decorations i think this is a really cool way to do it and also it just looks natural like it doesn't just look like some uniform terracotta or plant pot that you're putting in your tank it's like it looks like a natural rock. So I'm actually going to be putting these inside Hoku's tank. I am not going to be putting them in Nemo's because Nemo just eats the plants, which is pretty funny because when I try to give him like fresh vegetables and like romaine lettuce, he won't eat them. But with live plants, he will just 
tear them to shreds anyway. So we're gonna go ahead and see what Hoku thinks about these. And by the way, I mean, just like, how cute is that? Like, look at how adorable these plants are. Just an FYI for those of you who have seen kind of like my new background since I kind of changed stuff up. These are definitely not alive because I can't keep plants alive. So if these stay alive, I'm going to be super duper hyped about this. And I already am. I'm like super excited because I love live plants. In fact, I think these little guys need names. So if you have name suggestions for the plants, leave them down below. For reference, this plant here is a java fern and this is a dwarf sagittaria. So both of them need names, but let's go ahead and stick them in the tank. I don't know if my hand will let me let out all the air in there. Watch out, buddy. Okay, oh my gosh. Y'all, I have live plants in my tank. I'm, look at that color. It's so cute. So far, Hoku hasn't really investigated. So we'll see what he does. What you doing, bud? Oh no, no, don't eat it. I'm gonna cry if you eat that. What you think, buddy? Huh? You got some new plants? Do you not know how you feel? That's a, that's a stick. How do you feel about the plants though, bud? No, not for you. That's okay, it doesn't have to be, bye. Hello, are you gonna push that plant around? Oh yeah, you can't. Okay, you guys, so already I just love these plants because just look. They add so much just vibrancy and life to the tank. And so I'm really hoping we can keep these alive, which I'm actually very, very hopeful for the first time. There's Hoku back there. Hi, buddy. Hi, buddy. Just chilling. And we'll see how these guys do, but I think that Groot would be proud with the plants that are in this tank. But I am super duper stoked. Like, look at that. How cool does that look? I'm just like, oh, I'm in love with this plant. All right, so I've got the plants in the tank. And I mean, you can decide for yourself, but I think that they look pretty fantastic. And honestly, you guys have no idea how excited I was when I heard that they were coming out with these and when I heard about what it was. Because I have wanted to keep plants and like do live plants in my tanks for the longest time. And like you've seen, like I've got some Anubias, I've got some Java Moss growing in the breeder tank. But because I moved in the direction of turtles and both my tanks are turtle tanks, I've always been so scared to keep live plants because I just didn't want to plant it really directly in the substrate. I wasn't sure if it was going to be able to get nutrients down there. I was almost certain that the turtle was going to uproot it if it didn't eat it. And so I just stayed away from live plants. But with this, it just makes it so easy. You just literally put the plant that's already in a pot inside one of these planters and you stick it in the tank, maybe put some root tabs and you're good to go. Like easy. That is so easy. And it set the bar like way lower where I felt like I could actually, I don't know, try plants in here. So I'm super stoked about this and kudos to Aquarium Co-op for coming up with a solution like this. I think that if you're a turtle owner, you should at least give this a shot because heck, live plants just look so good. So you guys can pick this up on their website, The Easy Planters. They're only $9.99, so it's a really good deal. Also, if you need live plants to go along with those planters, then you can also get them from their website. As you guys saw when I unboxed them, packaged really well, shipped really fast, Highly, highly, highly recommend. So thank you Aquarium Co-op for sending this over for me to try. Let me know if you guys wanna see an update on these plants or if you want to see me try putting them with Nemo. I have a feeling he might massacre them, but I don't think it would hurt to try it because I think like, look at how good that looks. I'm, I'm kind of wanting to try plants in Nemo's tank. So let me know if you wanna kind of see a part two of this video where I try putting plants in Nemo's tank, but I think this is a great solution for turtle owners. So yeah, just comment down below if you want to see more live plants in turtle tanks content. 
because I am very excited about this whole new experience of trying to keep live plants alive. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, feel free to drop a thumbs up down below. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you all next Friday. Have a totally awesome day. Bye-bye. Come here. It's so cute. It is. Look at the green. It makes it look so nice. Why haven't you done it before with fake ones? I haven't done it before because... It's too much work. With fake ones? Because they just grow algae. And because they don't look as real. And because, like, to the point. If it's not real. Hmm? Why didn't you ever do that? I never did real plants because the turtle would uproot the thing. Or I was scared it was going to eat it. That's why this is such a good idea. Mommy, so I, I gotta film my outro from? again. Look Bye. Okay, wait, I'm recording. I'm so excited. Oh, don't eat them. Don't even think, look at him. Don't even think about eating them. I see you. He's thinking about I see it. you.